Hello, this is Dr. Jen, the Intuitive Phoenix, here to talk to you. If you are somebody who, like you've got money, and yet you're miserable, or you're experiencing success in your career or business, in your personal life, as far as your relationships, and you're stressed to the max, there's an important piece that is missing. Now, you might think, well, is this... Am I talking to you? And I'd like you to answer these questions for yourself. And if they resonate with you, then yes, I'm talking to you. When you post on social media, do you find that the pictures you post make you feel uncomfortable in your gut because you're showing the positive side of things? You're showing what's good in your life. But if people really knew what was going on inside of you, it wouldn't match the pictures on social media. Or you're having conversations in your head that are different than what actually comes out of your mouth. Like somebody might say, like, hey, you know, it looks like life is going great. Business is going great. And you're trying to formulate what do you say that doesn't contradict that, but at the same time in your head, you're going, yeah, if they only knew. Or maybe you get pissed off, offended, upset when somebody questions your work, your business, your career, or maybe your ability in an important role in your life. And you're so upset, you can't believe that they would dare say such a thing. This is another sign that there's a piece missing. I made a list. Maybe, whether again, it's your life or your business, your career, you feel like only you can get it right. Only you can do it the way it's supposed to be done that you do it the best. And frankly, if you're not there, then, well, shit might hit the fan. Things might break down. That you work so hard, but don't dare take time away from your work because without you, it would crash. Without you, things might fall apart and break down. And then where would you be? That you're sought after in your field, and yet you're sick all the time. Every time you turn around, you're not feeling 100%. You're catching colds. You're catching the bug that's going around. Um, yeah, you just never feel entirely well. You are at the bottom of your priority list. You're so busy taking care of others, putting others first, responding to what others need and want, that when, actually if, you have time to take care of you, you're so exhausted, so drained, or there's so little time that you think, why bother? Or that you're somebody who thought when you achieved success or reached a certain level of income that life would just get better. And yet it hasn't. That you still feel raw oh, inside. Or maybe you have success in business, success in your career, but your relationships are like wah, wah, wah. or the other. Maybe relationships, you're doing well. You have good, healthy relationships outside of work, but work, yeah, not going so well. All of these, and these are just a short list of what tells me there is a disconnect. There's a disconnect between the you that you show to the world and the you on the inside. 
the you that you're aware of. And the missing piece that leads us to that is, where is the true you? In all of this, if you were to ask yourself, if life could be as you want to live it, as you want to experience it, what would it look like? What would it feel like? And what would you feel, how would you feel in your body doing those things, experiencing those things, living those things? What would that feel like? Now, for me, I call it my fucking fantastic. There are times in my life that I can't find another word to say how phenomenal things are, how fantastic, how awesome, how stupendous. I'll use those words, and it's just not enough. And till one day, and this was some years ago, that I finally said, you know what it is? Things are fucking fantastic. And even saying it right now, I can feel the hairs on my arms like stand up. There's tingling. I can feel this energy flowing. And because it feels different than fantastic, it feels different than awesome. And it's when I'm connected to me. It's when I know and own and understand my value as a human being, as a person who has something unique to offer to this world. It's, and it's at that point that things start clicking and coming together because I own and know and feel comfortable in my skin in my body, in what I'm saying, in what I'm sharing, and in how I'm living my life. At that moment or those moments, I almost can't imagine that life is this good. I was kind of sitting there in the, oh, this is good. This is good. It feels good. So, my question. When do you show up as truly you? And you know you show up as truly you when, this is the way I describe it for myself, things click together. You feel on fire. You feel like things are coming easier. They're lining up for you. You feel your inner power. And you're confident. You trust yourself. If this is something, if you heard yourself and what I shared in this live, I'd love to hear what you have to say. I'd love to know what thoughts came to your mind, came into your awareness. Feel free to post them. Feel free to, well, ask questions. And if you're one of those people who says, yeah, you know what? I do have money and I'm miserable. I do have success in some areas of my life and I'm stressed to the max. If you're wanting to connect that missing piece so that way you can feel the fucking fantastic in your life, then in the comments, what's the word I want? Let me see. What's the word I want? Well, 
post fantastic. In the comments, post fantastic. And when you post fantastic, I will share with you my doobie list. My doobie list is one of my tools that I use to make sure that missing piece is in fact connected. All right, again, post fantastic in the comments. If you're ready to receive my doobie list because you want that missing piece connected, you want to be experiencing life without the stress, without the overwhelm and feeling good, not just in business or not just in relationships, but in all areas of your life. If you're ready for that, send me a message. Until we meet again, I'm sending you health and love and ease in your transformation. I'll talk to you then.